my activism, my activism was accidental. Um, a very well-known Fafafine identity in Samoa died in front of my house. Um, and it resonated with me growing up, the idea that some people are not allowed um, to have the freedom of expression, to express who they are um, within their communities. And I became involved with the Samoa Fafafine Association and many years later, um, a law criminalizing female personation was repealed um, based on my submission. Um, I'm trans, um, I'm Fafafine, I'm post-operative trans, I'm a mother of two boys, um, and they're rainbow kids, they, 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 they know who their, their mother is, and, 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 and they join me in my efforts to stamp out um, ignorance against um, LGBTI and Fafafine people. Um, that's how I became an activist and seeing my kids now that I'm a responsible parent, um, I want to do my bit to, to remove ignorance and, 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 and anti-LGBTI, anti-Fafafine sentiment within my community. And if I can help do that for my children and, 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 and push back a couple of people, I've done my part.